what's up good job guys variety blitz here and today we will be making a video about critical belt and uh, we're here at the gizmo workshop and today i'll be explaining every single parts in here their functions and uh yeah their functionality and so on and so forth okay so uh today we'll be talking about the first three components right here the gizmo engines the gizmo wheels and the gizmo propellers so on our next episode we'll be talking about the gizmo steering the other parts and the building blocks okay so we'll be uh, uh having a review on each and one of them uh per episode okay so now let's start with the gizmo engine so gizmo engines uh this are the engines that uh actually these are the parts rather that are very essential because uh your uh Gizmo will not, uh, you know, will not uh, work without this. Okay, so uh, this is actually the engine. Uh, literally speaking, the one that makes your Gizmo move. And uh, the there are uh, different designs rather uh, here. And um, each design, each unique design has a unique, uh, what do you call that? A uh, unique purpose, yeah, and fun functionality. And uh, yeah so this is very essential because without this your wheels will not move okay so uh, you must put the gizmo engine most probably uh below your uh, gizmo or uh maybe it's specifically uh, located at the back or at the middle okay so i prefer to put that below your gizmo at the middle part middle middle part and uh, i think it will also work on the uh, uh what do you call that the uh lower part of your gizmo okay so uh take note on that okay so next thing is we have the gizmo wheels so gizmo wheels um of course we need we need uh gizmo engines but we still need gizmo wheels i mean without wheels how are your gizmo is going to uh you know move i mean no wheels no everything okay so we have here different kinds of wheels with different qualities depending on your uh, play style you know if you want a uh, you know heavy wheel that is somehow you know similar to a tank wheel so we have a heavy wheel level 2 and of course a heavy wheel level 1 and, and of course this wheels can uh, uh, what do you call that uh, accelerate better on uh, high terrains and um, compared to the normal gizmo so we also have the sticky wheel which is actually i think the best wheel in here because you know any terrain you can actually you know you can actually uh stick with every you know uh what to call that landscape there so this is actually good but the design of sticky wheel i think it will not look uh what to call that uh appealing to every gizmo that you'll build so uh, that's why they actually built several types of uh, wheels you know uh, not just for the functional functionality but also for the uh what do you call that charisma points okay so that's it okay so we have different kinds of wheels depending on your type and uh, yeah so wheels are actually located on the sides uh, your gizmo will probably work if it has four or more wheels i mean three wheels could do but i think it will not be as balanced as what it is compared to a four wheel gizmo and you can also do a two wheel gizmo and actually create a motor type gizmo but uh i still prefer the four wheel type gizmo because i don't like motorcycles i mean i'm more of a car person not a motor cycle one. okay so uh, the last gizmo part that we'll review for this day is the gizmo propellers so the gizmo propellers uh, are essential for flying and uh, i think this is actually very essential honestly speaking because without this your your gizmo will not fly and uh no uh there are several uh what to call that uh, designs that has uh, different characteristics so uh, you just have to check each and one so uh, i think each of them work perfectly it's just that uh the, the types in here the different designs in here are dedicated for 
the aesthetics of your gizmo so uh, i think depending on your gizmo i mean the the design of the propeller depends on your gizmo maybe if you're actually going to build a uh, an airplane gizmo maybe this one is suitable for that or if you want a submarine gizmo maybe this one is probably good as well so depending on your uh, gizmo type you can actually pick any of these and the, and most probably they all have the same functionality and uh, I think it will not matter I mean the durability I think the durability is for battle purposes but um, aside from that everything in here they're all they're almost similar okay they're almost similar and if you're actually going to look at them the, uh, the statistics that they have is close to each other that is why you know it will not make or break stuff no <clears throat> I said no. Okay, that's actually excuse me. That's actually a Filipino term. So yeah, uh, going back to the topic, uh, this acceleration engine, power handling, and weight. I think the stats are perfect, and uh, they're so close, close to each other. And I think they aren't going to change the game, okay, or change the way your gizmo will move. Okay, so they're all similar. It's just that it's for the aesthetics. Okay, so. Uh, that's for me, okay. If you think that the there are some there are some purposes, hidden purposes of this gizmo propellers, just just comment that in the comment section, okay? So uh, yeah. Alright, guys. Thank you for watching, and uh, we'll be having another video on our next episode, and uh, that is going to be about the uh, gizmo steering other parts and the building blocks, okay? So yeah. And as always, I'm Red Bits, and uh, just remember, you're ready. So yeah guys, don't forget to subscribe for you guys.